Hey everybody, how's it going? So we're going to be doing the series of 2004 runner U-joint replacements for the drive shaft. Uh, so please stick around and I'll see you there. Thanks for watching. Alright everybody, I'm going to be removing, I already loosened one of the bolts, as you can see. So we're gonna loosen the second one, and then we're gonna have to move the drive shaft. so I can go get that pen. Just grabbed a metal marker. Come on. I need to mark this side too. Can you not turn the camera? You can hear that it's yeah. it's pretty messed up. want to go put up top or do you want me to do it? I can put a neutral heel on. Okay. Right here. You're going to have to push the emergency brake down first. 
I'm gonna step on the brake or it won't turn. Okay. Oh, fuck, that's hot. Yeah, come on, get the blanket for me. Emergency brake. Huh? The emergency brake. I know. Step on the brake. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna have to put you down. Okay. It's in neutral? Yeah. No, it's not. Yes, it no, it's not. The truck is rolling. It's in neutral. Okay, put it back in park. Start the truck. Neutral. Turn, put it in the park. Turn it off. It shouldn't be rolling. Huh. All right, well, I'm just gonna have to have you put it back in neutral. I'm gonna have to force the truck to move then. Yeah. It's not turning. Shifted into like first gear or something. Hold it in park or hold it in the brake and put it in first gear. No, it's not. It's below drive. That's fine. Now put it back in neutral. Oh, come on. Let off the brake. Okay, put it in park. Start it off. Okay. It's not supposed to do that. But. Ooh, the back back one is bad too. Okay, we'll be right back. I gotta go get another part. All right, everybody. My wife went and um, went to go grab the other. U joint. So I'm gonna do this holding the camera. Hopefully that you guys can see this. Here's one. This 
three loose. They're pretty tight. You do have to put a little force into them. They're at 65 foot pounds. All right. So I'll get you a little closer. There's two nuts on the bottom, two nuts on the top. There's four total, and then there's the bolts. And there is lock washers on it. These are grade 11 bolts. So, kind of put the lean the camera down. Sorry for all the movement. Looks like they put green, some kind of green Loctite on it. So I'm gonna put blue Loctite back on them when we go back to install finish installing it they are greasable front and rear so um, let's see if I can get the, the other bolt off do this one-handed There's that. I'm probably gonna hit the holes with a wire brush, to clean the rust out if there's any rust in them. Like this bolt has some rust on it. I can reach the top too. So. Looks like my diff is leaking a little. a little bit let's see why it's leaking later looks like it's leaking from the back Got all four bolts out. All right, so I'm gonna stop the video right here. 
part two will be the next uh, uh, section of the video. So stick around and I'll see you guys next time. To be continued.